All right, here's another favorite activity of mine, and we have not done this one in class, so I'm excited to share something new with you. Uh, it's shared by Steve Wyborny. He's the one that's created all these, and I'm going to show you how it works. So in your Shared With Me, you're going to see a folder called Splat. And if you want, if you like these and you don't want to lose where they are in your Shared With Me, you can always add that star, and then you're always going to have them in your star folder. So there's four different levels for now. Um, we'll start with Splat 2 and there's five different ones in here. So if you double click them, sorry, double click them, um, they're set up as PowerPoints for Microsoft, so they don't open the same way um, as a Google slide. But if you click open with, you can scroll down, but I'll explain why afterwards it doesn't work the same. If you open with Google Slides, and he had this little box here just because he has two versions. Some of them don't convert properly to Google Slides. He's gone through the effort to make two sets, which is amazing. So you hit present. You want it in full um, play mode. Even if you're on an iPad or a tablet, make sure it's in present mode um, because everything's animated. So we're using the numbers from 12 to 20 and using some mental math. So the first one, uh, and the first one of every slide, he goes through the instructions. How many blue shapes do you see? And you could, if you're doing this with somebody in your house, you could see who is able to count or supertize them quicker. Um, we have 19 here. And then, splat! How many shapes are under the splat and how do you know? So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10... 11 outside of the splat, so how many must be under if there's 19 in total? Well, for me, I think about 19 and 11, that means there must be 8 underneath, because 11, 1 and 1, 1 and 8 is 9, 11 and 8 is 19. How else could I know the addition or the subtraction? And then it goes gray and you can count them, and there are 8 in this case. Um, so then there's a whole bunch more. So that's the level two. And we'll go back and we will look at level three. There is a level one on his website if you have younger siblings and you want to do from numbers um, zero to ten. Um, you could do those with your siblings. So again, open with. And while we wait for that, the, he does have a fraction one, so you know that's going to be coming. Hmm, this one's taking a little while. Okay, so same thing, you want to make sure it's in present mode. And this set includes multiple splats. Remember, each splat of the same color must have the same number. So what does that mean? Again, we start with how many shapes in total? Well, I see 5, 10, and 4 is 14, 14. Splat! But now there's two splats, and these are both of the same color, so they must have the same amount underneath each. Okay, so we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 outside of it. So 14 subtract 8, or you might do 14 subtract 4, gives you 10, subtract another 4, gives you 6. So there's 6 missing, or 6 being covered up. So then if they have to be in equal piles, and there's two piles, six divided by two is three, and let's see, three in both of them. So that's how level two works, or level three works. Uh, have fun, List, try with somebody else in your house, see what their approaches are. Uh, it's not about speed, but it uh, could be a fun challenge for those of you that are competitive.